We welcome you to the campus of TCU and Schollmeyer Arena. Today, the Horned Frogs of TCU open up 2021 versus the number seven team in the country, the Lady Bears of Baylor. Dee Dee Richards on, nice pick. Heard with a steal. Richards right behind her, the defensive player of the year, rejected by Moon Erson. That's a three. Barry! And that would be critical for TCU. Reagan Peebley and Kim Mulkey both out with contact tracing. And they just bang it inside with Hannah Guster so far in this game. Yeah, but both teams playing really hard on defense, but both teams are going to have to clean it up. Nice double on Smith, and she just shoots over everybody. Didn't mm -hmm. go too early, didn't go too late, and foul. Perfect timing. And the three by Aaliyah Jackson stops a 6-0 Baylor run. A lot of Baylor fans, and that's the case again today. Smith inside. That's almost impossible to stop. Their zone. Uh, now I doubt that that's what Baylor will settle for. Heard with the three, her first field goal made this afternoon after starting out 0 for 5. Kept her hands on it and finished through a little bit of contact. Count the basket, Michelle Berry. Yeah, nice pull up by Berry. And Last four opponents of TCU have shot under 43%. That is a three. And restart the process of cutting into this lead. 21 rebounds already in the ball game for Baylor and Caitlin Bickle knocks down her second three-pointer of the year. The TCU starts the half back in the man-to-man. -man. You know, they finished the half in that zone. It was pretty effective. Urson just showed patience. And frankly, it'll it'll have an influence on, on how Baylor's guarded down the stretch the rest of the season. Yummy Morris. Straight up with Egbo, yes. A year ago, she gets overshadowed a little bit because, mm -hmm. you know, those three seniors were so good. But now she's showing you. It's, just, <laughs> it's her chance, right? Yummy Morris just faces up, knocks it down. Here in this half. Dee Dee Richards playing her tough, and she rejects the shot. It's still struggling shooting the basketball today. On the drive, out the basket, Tavi Diggs. Yeah, nice job by Tavi. Got a good look at it again. Carrington pulls it away. Oh, nice pass. Smith running the floor well. They know how to help helpers. They're just an outstanding defensive team. Season high for Moon Erson with 14. And in, in the length that you talked about is just, as you see, Carrington run through a passing lane for a steal. But, the, but that, that length, it just... Morris faces up on Bickle. Strong move, uses that left shoulder and got it. Attacked with a right hand and, and finished with that little half hook. First points for TCU in the quarter and then Carrington bombs away with a three. Really good depth on this team. They've got a lot of ways to play and a lot of people that can come in and make an impact. We compare notes on grandsons, so I think that's what we do. From the outside, the three goes down by Michelle Berry. Everybody who has played for TCU has scored only one player in double figures. Here comes Diggs. Off, oh, stops. Urson playing a little defense. Diggs again, this time bangs it home. Urson inside. Nice pass into the hands of Gusters. Tip your hat, move on, figure out what you need to work on, get to the next game. Richards on the drive, and Dee Dee Richards with 14 in the ball game. Once again, TCU drops one to Baylor, 74-50. Next game will be on Wednesday night.